I hope you're doing well. Today's gonna be a video on uh, perfumes I would take with me on holiday when going to the beach. So yes, um, if I do have a holiday plan, this is definitely gonna be uh, something I'm gonna literally bag up um, and decant some of these perfumes and definitely take them with me on my summer vacations when and if I have them. So yes, this is Amouage's 43. I'm definitely gonna have a tuberose perfume for me. Summer is about tuberose, white florals, vetiver, green notes, and citrus notes. So yes, this is um this is the tuberose, uh, I guess, part of the video. So this one I would wear for sure during the evening. I would even wear this in the morning, but you don't need to spray a lot of this one because it is quite, it is quite strong. So yes, it is an extra 43. Um, I think that was the oil content 43%. And yes, this is an amazing one to have. I've spoken about this one a lot and it is just a gorgeous perfume where it's just tuberose and just an elegant type of tuberose. You can definitely smell the chemicaliness from the bottle. But again, when you spray these perfumes, you're not going to be able to tell it is beautiful it is also a bridal scent for me so even if you are expecting to get married during um summer this is a really great one i may actually come out with video a video on um, bridal scents for the summer next we have sicily's eau de soir this one is just what you would expect Oh goodness, it's what you would expect to smell when you go to a bougie mansion. This is what you'd expect to smell everywhere in the house. It just smells so clean, so crisp. But this one has so many notes that I don't know if I can explain it to you, but it is the epitome of elegance. Um, on me, this one doesn't last, but it is an amazing one. People do say it lasts on them. This is an eau de parfum, so this is a great option to have. This one would be great for the evening. I mean, it does say eau de soir, so I believe it means evening so yes um this is a great one for the evenings when it comes to summer if you have a bougie dinner to go to uh yeah this is the one to uh, to spray and if you have an evening wedding this is a great one also for summer next you have more of a traditional one this is aqua allegoria orange soleil which is like a sole an orange an orange type of fragrance a citrusy one so this is a really great one to have if you just want something grab and go and it's not too too expensive i believe this one and it's a great one to have i've been using this one a lot more lately and i absolutely love it it does lean masculine for me a little bit maybe it's my skin chemistry i'm not sure but this does lean a bit masculine to me and for me um according to my nose so yes it is a great one to have it's orangey if you don't like orange do not even bother buying this because you'll absolutely hate it but this one is a very distinctive smell i mean this is definitely orange galore but in the nicest way it's like a sticky um orange but not too sickly sweet it's just like the perfect ripe orange that you're just literally stuffing your face with it is gorgeous this one this one does make me laugh a little bit, but I absolutely love it. I just sprayed this one on today, so it is my scent of the day. It is hot outside this week in the UK. It's been boiling. So yes, this is the Nivea. I believe this is the original. I only have the 30 ml because I don't really think I'd ever be using this. But yes, this is an amazing one in summer. If you just want something for the morning, you can put this one on on top of your Nivea SPF and it's going to be great. This one's a, just a very one and done uh, type of situation you spray it on in the morning and you expect to go swimming later on afterwards because this one does not last to save anyone's life at least on not on me um it is a believe an eau de toilette i'm not sure actually yes it is an eau de toilette oh excuse the markings i guess the markings i mean the uh, design kind of comes off which is fine uh i don't expect anything more or less from nivea this is the cheapest one by the way in this whole list so yeah this is one that you would wear before going to the pool so when you have breakfast or when you go for lunch this one you could wear um yeah you can wear during those times last but not least we have tom ford gray vetiver again a vetiver perfume during this time is amazing like the earthiness of it is gorgeous again this one smells like a bougie wipe it just smells amazing is it more masculine leaning i think i honestly think a woman or a man could wear this but if i was to pick a side it would be uh more masculine leaning for me but i mean vetiver everyone kind of assumes it's like a 
you know, a masculine type of smell, but still, um, not everyone, but majority of the people, but still, anyways, this is a great one to have. I always wear this when I come out of the shower. So even if you want to go for a dinner, um, like a pre dinner walk, this is the one that I can imagine people wearing in the breeze. It's just going to smell so good and it's so light and it's so airy. So yes, thank you all so much for watching my video. I really appreciate it. And uh, let me know what perfumes you'd be wearing this summer. And um, do you en did you enjoy any of my recommendations? Do you want to buy any of them? And yeah, see you all in my next video. Like and subscribe. Take care. Bye.